Welcome Pisces. Let's see what is going to be coming up for your full moon Pisces. I hope you guys are doing well. This is a full moon of May. It's going to be on the 26th of May. All right. So whatever is happening and transpiring, I see a lot of you are going to be recognizing um, what is uh, going to be coming up. Please like and share if you want to see the extended of this reading. Use the link to join um, and take the second subscription. Pisces, so what is coming up for you guys? Let's see what is coming up. All right, I see information is going to be coming out. You have the energy of the eye princess. This is a full moon. Um, this is your um, mother energy. So um, a lot of you Pisces are going to be finding out something that you were not aware of, okay? Um, and it is about an Aries Leo or a Sagittarian man. His secrets is going to be coming out. They are going to be recognizing what an Aries Leo or a Sagittarian man have done. I see a lot of you Pisces is going to be surprised at what this man was capable of. You were not even aware what this man was doing. And a lot of you Pisces is going to be surprised at who this man said he was. I see that this could be your father for some of you Pisces. And a whole lot of secrets is going to be coming out about your father and who your father was. And I see a lot of you Pisces is trying to um is trying to figure out oh my god how comes i didn't know this a lot of you pisces was dealing with an aries the or such dear and man who was your lover this man was only in the relationship for money uh it is all about money for this man okay a whole lot of conflicts some of you were do, dealing um uh, with a whole lot of conflicts over money in the third week a whole lot of conflicts over money then we see this energy of this empress um some of you is your mother some of you is your wife you're going to be dealing with some sort of a um conflicts with this person and a whole lot of money okay i see the truth is coming out about this person um whoever it is is your wife or your a sister but it's more of a wife or your mother and a whole lot of information is going to be coming out i see a lot of you a aries a leo man that some of you were dealing with you're going to be finding out the truth about this leo man or a aries leo or sagittarius okay what you're coming in with you're going to be overcoming an aries leo or sagittarian man um, they're going to be recognizing what this Aries Leo or Sagittarian man have done. The Four of uh, Swords. I see um, that a lot of you or your um, inner mental anguish is going to be over over a situation that was happening in your world that an Aries Leo or Sagittarian man have caused in your world. So a lot of you coming in this full moon, moving in. And stand in your grounds because you recognize that an Aries Leo or Sagittarian man had a whole lot of secrets and you were not even aware of this. And you're not recognizing how much secrets this man has hold. I see you're trying to find inner strength to deal with, uh, especially young people, you're trying to find inner strength to deal with some sort of a secrecy that came out about a whole lot of money. So a lot of you Pisces young people. Um, some sort of a secrecy over a whole lot of money is going to be coming out because they're going to be recognizing. A lot of you are trying to deal with your your father or a Aries or Sagittarian man. And this man is a businessman and the lies and deceptiveness of this businessman and his wife. And they're now recognizing. And a lot of you Pisces are going to be recognizing that this Aries or Sagittarian man and his wife... <laughs> Okay, so you're going to be successfully overcoming the secrecy of an Aries Leo Sagittarian man. This man could have been an auto dealer or this man could be a businessman, but they're going to be recognizing this man could be in another country and this, they're going to be recognizing Jesus Christ. This man, whatever he said was not true. A lot of you are going to be successfully overcoming this man because his secrets is going to be coming out. And a lot of you are going to be recognizing the man hasn't speak a word of truth. Then we see a lot of you are waiting to hear from your kids or you young people are waiting to hear some sort of a news result um, with some sort of an exam that some of you do in the second week. In the third week, I see people at the workplace is... Uh, 
um, is a week where a lot of you are going to be uh, um, asking for higher salaries and some sort of uh, um, trying to resolve some sort of a salary issue or resolve some sort of a situation with um, service. So it's as if you give service and you weren't paid. Uh, this is as if there is problems with um, you receiving um, money from your debitors or, you know, and debitor creditors. So it is a situation where you're having some sort of a conflict that some sort of a service that was given was not properly done. And, you know, um, you are having problem with this person. I see a whole lot of you Pisces want to reunite with your wife or with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person or reunite with your mom. And, you know, whoever this is, is that some of you now recognize that an Aries or Sagittarian man had lied and uh, you're trying to reunite with this person to apologize to this person. You want some new start with this person because you recognize that this man has told you only lies and deceptiveness about this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person. And now the truth is being revealed. A lot of you, this is a reunion that you want to happen between you and the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person because you recognize that people had a, um, a lied about this person and created a whole lot of issue um, around this person. So um, it is a situation where I see a lot of you, um, Pisces, that was uh, either you like this person or, you know, this person, you recognize that this person had a whole lot of... Uh, potential and it could be a business person that could have helped you and here is the or Sagittarian man I'd like to you about this person and you have worked against this person and now you want to reconnect with this person but this reunion is not going to be happening because this person recognized that you had the right to, to kind of recognize uh, what was going on but because you were led by money this person is like, you know, I'm happy with the money that you got to sell me out. I don't want to really deal with you anymore. All right. So it, this is a situation. A lot of you Pisces is going to be successfully overcoming some sort of an issue where people had used uh, um, your service or tried to get away with a whole lot of money and you're going to be standing your ground. All right. Let's go in and see the mm, sun sign rising people. So I see a lot of you sun sign rising people is traveling to somewhere to connect with a Aries Leo or Sagittarian man and is going to be finding out a whole lot of lies about this man and his wife. And I see... <laughs> that you are like jesus wow i had no idea this man really pulled the wool over my eyes a whole lot of secrets um some of you who were dealing with a leo man a whole lot of secrets maybe this was your husband or um uh, your brother or a family member who a whole lot of secrets and you are like jesus christ but um, you know, a lot of you are going to be overcoming this person. Some of you could be having some sort of um problems with your car and having a problems with your auto dealership. Okay, a tower moment is coming down because all the secrets is going to be coming out about Leo. And um, some of you were connected with a Leo, whoever this Leo is. Um, you know, were you in a relationship with this Leo or business with this Leo? A tower moment is coming down. For the secrets of this Leo, Aries Leo or Sagittarian, it's more of an Aries and a Leo person. Um, their secrets is coming out and people are going to be recognizing um, the disturbing, uh, deceptive uh, information that this person is like this person sell you a story that was not true. Truths are going to be coming out. Truths are coming out and some of you... Um, Pisces are going to be blown out of the water to find out the truth about what exactly was going on. You Pisces are going to be like Jesus. If only I'd known, I would not have gotten involved with this, this situation. It's as if you got dragged in because of gossip information coming at you and people are sure and, and people are telling you and you recognize nothing that this person said was true. At work, I see a lot of you are going to be making a lot of money. This is a this is a, a week um, to ask for a salary raise. OK, it is a good week because the energy um, in this week is the third week. OK, the energy is going to be good 
to na um, navigate your salaries okay um, and this is going to be um, very positive so go for it so if you're having a new job in a new job or um, it is the extending of your can contract you can ask for a salary in in increase and you can navigate it um, to what you want and you will get what you want okay I see an end is coming up because I see um, a lot of you wanted to reconnect with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn, but this person is not interested. This person has left the building. This person is looking for better shores, better water. This person just recognized that uh, you were not on the same place, pace with them or not in the same energy vibration. And this person is like, it's good. I'm fine. I am okay. I wish you success. Namaste. So whatever that was happening between you and this um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person, you sold them out and you are now trying to come back to them and recognizing that what what people were saying was not true. But, you know, this person is like, you know, I'm playing as a book. I'm open as a book. You should have recognized that. So, you know, a lot of people pay you and you took money and you throw me onto the bus but now you're recognizing oh so my work was good so you're coming back to me and i see if even this person do work for you they're going to be holding you at a distance it's good bam this is it no no friendship no social socializing because this person know exactly what you do but this person is going to be the better man and nothing um the most diplomatic people in this world is uh, earth sign people they're very diplomatic especially when they have business they're very diplomatic and they recognize that of all of you pisces uh, um choose another side and throw them under the bus and here you now find out that a Leo was not speaking the truth. You now find out that an Aries or a Sagittarian man was not speaking the truth. The truth came out and now you're recognizing and now you're trying to like, um, okay, um, let's see if I can reconnect. But you can't connect with this person because this person is not going to give you, um, not going to give you uh, the connection to connect with them. All right. All right, so what we're looking at, uh, 88, a lot of you Pisces, Sun Sun Pisces, um, some sort of tower moment could be coming down with your financial um, Sun Pisces. So if you were born 6 a.m. to 6 p.m., because that is the region, some sort of a tower moment could be coming down for your financial um, stability. And it's because you're divorcing your wife. Your wife is going to be taking F, okay? Uh, moon sign people, people who were born 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. Um, we see you wanted some sort of a reunion, but um, you're going to be getting some sort of a communication that this person is not interested. Uh, this person is going to be making it very clear. I'm not interested. Uh, you make your choice and the choices that you have made. You have to deal with them. You have to live with them. Um, you know, it, it, I'm not interested to reconnect with you because of what you have done. All right. The seven of ones. And this is, uh, uh some sort of, uh, uh, situation where a lot of you are going to be recognizing I make the wrong choices, whether it's of the work for whether it's friends, whether it's some sort of a situation that was uh, happening. Uh, you listen to other people and did not believe, uh, um, someone and this person is going to be okay just let it go I don't want to work on this I don't want to talk about it I don't want to. this karmatic situation between you and I it is as ended I have cut the cord the erratic cord between you and I this is ended I don't want a new start okay so whatever that was transpiring um the energy of the five of uh, uh, you're you're regretting a conflict. You're regretting a conflict. It could have been, um, you were you know you had someone you were dealing with, and this person did good service for you, but because of other people, uh, um, dishonesty, you left this person, and now you're recognizing, oh my God, you left this person. Tried to create a whole lot of problem with this person. And this person was very good for you. They did very good work for you. And now you're recognizing, um, you know, this is the only person that uh, 
um, you know, believe in what they're doing and not how much money I can pay them. And I see a lot of you recognize that, you know, I created um, an issue and this person was very good. And I see regrets because you recognize that this person know what you have done and you dare not return to this person. And you regret this situation. You regret what you have done because you recognize that this person was coming from a good place. And you kind of mess it up because you listen to other people and you work uh, um, work against this person. And now you recognize there's no coming back to this person. Um, I see um, a whole lot of money is going to be coming in. Like women who were waiting on some sort of a financial uh, support for your children. So Pisces women, congratulations. Um, a whole lot of money is going to be coming in that is going to be helping you Pisces women um, to support um, your kids and that sort of a thing. So congratulations. Some sort of a new contract is going to be coming in. And I see whatever is transpiring is as if a, a Leo man was trying to create some sort of a problem for a lot of you, but you're going to be overcoming. It's as if this Leo man tried to um, um, block some sort of a contract or took a contract that was yours. And I see now they recognize what this Leo man have done and you're going to be celebrating over this Leo man because you, they're going to be recognizing that this Leo man lied and created some sort of a contract that was not his and took a whole lot of money on the false pretend he and his partner. So I see a huge celebration over this Leo man and they're recognizing that this Leo man has created some sort of a false contract. And they are bringing an end to this false contract that this Leo man has created. So I see a lot of you. You were you were um you were really um upset and very upset over that there was some sort of a double contract, and they're going to be recognizing that this Leo man was either on your computer or either had changed some sort of a data and information and falsify um some sort of a a contract and created some sort of a new contract and they're going to be recognizing that this Leo man was the one because they're going to be going back in a computer system like a company or a corporation recognize hey this is double and they're going to be going back to see who created um, a contract under somebody else's company name and they're going to be recognized that this uh, that a Leo man was the one who did it and gave it to someone else so they're going to be um firing this Leo man for what um this Leo man have done I see a huge success is coming out over this Leo man wow I'm telling you um there is corruption all over the place and there's criminal in er in, in every corporation um, and people are going to be recognizing. So I see the tower moment is coming down on a Leo man and they're going to be recognizing that a Leo man have created and falsified some sort of a documentation and created some sort of a false, false company under somebody else's company name and was uh, um, taking a lot of money and using this person um, data and information to acquire a whole lot of wealth. And a huge tower moment is coming down on this Leo man because they found out the secret of this Leo man and what this Leo man was doing. I do love you guys. I gotta go, but I'm saying namaste until next time.